Hello everyone. Today was a good day in the market for everyone, hopefully. And uh, Nifty has gained about uh, 128 points today. And uh, can we consider this as a market reversal? If this is a market reversal, where will Nifty go? Why there was a green day today? And uh, how Bank Nifty is going to perform? What is the FADA data? Let's all discuss this now. But before that, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Click the notification bell icon and select all for instant notification for all the videos. So let's get started. So this is the nifty daily chart and uh, yesterday I was speaking about uh, nifty will reach this zone around uh, 16400 to 16350. Uh, if it is falling more uh, but i have also mentioned that uh, 16900 is a minor support and if it is taking a support there uh, we may also see a market reversal from there but what happened today is uh, nifty has breached that uh, 16900 range and it has uh, gone down up to 16830 835 and then uh, it bounced back today was a uh, gap down and uh, in the first five minutes itself uh, the gap was filled in the upper direction and also nifty recovered beautifully today's first five minute low was acting as the low for the entire day although the market is uh, hugely volatile uh, nifty gained about uh, 129 points which is a good sign and uh, the candle looks stronger in uh, daily time frame i'll switch it to 15 minutes time frame uh, if you see this is the this is the first 15 minutes candle for today it's like uh, all the sell orders were executed first and then uh, buyers came back in with uh, huge uh, amounts so we saw a good reversal in the first 15 minutes itself and then it was taking a good run still uh, there are some lows and highs for today uh, but at the end uh, nifty managed to do well so we are in for a good day today and uh, Bank Nifty it is going to be like uh, kind of a bullish engulfing pattern and uh, yesterday also I told uh, this zone is a good support zone so exactly at this zone uh, Bank Nifty has formed a good engulfing pattern almost uh, most of the banking stocks were good today uh, especially with uh, some good results like Axis Bank, Bandhan Bank, uh, HFC Bank uh, it was a good day today in uh, Bank Nifty also. Uh, since there is a bullish engulfing pattern I am still bullish on uh, bank nifty uh, if this is broken about uh, 338,375 range uh, we are going to see a good run here uh, last time uh, there was a small uh, bre breach but uh, it was not strong enough uh, I have mentioned that in the previous videos also it was not strong enough but uh, this particular bullish engulfing candle is looking uh, very strong so we can expect uh, nifty to breach uh, 38,375 range uh, by Thursday hopefully and uh, if you see the global queues uh, Nasdaq is uh, trading at uh, about uh, 2.88 dollars down uh, what it has closed uh, now it has changed to three dollars minus three dollars and it is kind of uh, in a doji pattern now and uh, yesterday when I was recording the video it was down about 3-4 uh, percentage and then it bounced back uh, very good over the midnight so we saw a good recovery in the markets all over the world so we have to wait for uh, Nasdaq's finish today and also tomorrow we are uh, our Indian stock market is not working tomorrow due to the Republic Day and if you see Dow Jones future uh, it is trading around uh, minus uh, 373 dollars which is uh, one percentage uh, but still it has done a small gap up today and it is uh, trading in the red zone today but still uh, it has recovered beautifully now itself still five hours to go uh, so we can expect the Dow Jones to end in green zone again for the second consecutive day if it is ending today and tomorrow in a green zone uh, we can expect a gap up in uh, Indian markets on Thursday if you see FIIDA selling data the FII has sold for about hugely uh, around uh, 7100 crores and uh, DA has bought about 
4535 crores so even if after this uh, there was a selling of about uh, 2500 crores uh, so which is huge but the candle for uh, nifty and bank nifty are indicating uh, reversals even then we have to wait for uh, global queues tomorrow and how sgx nifty is performing today. and i have got some stocks for uh, thursday which are looking bullish uh, which i will explain in the later video if there is uh, any more stocks i can add that and uh, i'll explain it tomorrow so we are having a telegram group uh, where we update uh, daily important news and uh, major results uh, ipo listings uh, etc so please do make sure that you are joining that channel i'll leave the link in description please do make use of it so that's it for the video guys uh, let us catch up tomorrow